hi thank you for clicking on this video today this is how to create youtube thumbnails using the inshot app if you don't have the inshot app you can download it from your app store once you're here tap on photo then tap on blank go to canvas and change it to 16 by 9 that is the size for youtube and then tap on check then come here to background to change the color of the background you can change it to a gradient or a solid color or a pattern whatever you want to use i'm just going to pick a color check then to add your picture go to sticker tap on this photo icon here this is an image i just used to practice but i'm going to show you how you can get your image like this tap on cut out then bring in the image you have already taken the one you want to use for your thumbnail give it a minute and it will have the background removed then tap on check now you can also um, move your image to wherever you want it to be you can use your two figures to pull it in to make it bigger or make it smaller or you can also use this icon here to enlarge it or reduce it you can also add outlines to your image by clicking on any of the ones down here. I just touched the first one and I'm going to reduce it to the way I like. After that, you check and check. To add text, click on text and you're going to write your text, what you want to be on your timeline. Make sure not to put too much text on your, on your thumbnail, I mean. Make sure not to put use too much text or else to, it will become crowded. So you can change the font by tapping on this icon. I'm just going to make it bolder. Then change the color of your text. Tap on color. Tap on label. I just want to give it like a white box to make the text pop more. Tap on any of this and you can change the color. Now we have a white box. We also need to change the color of our text so that it can be visible on the, on the box. Now, if the, any of the fonts you want to use is not here, you can buy a font for free. You just need to watch an ad. Click on the shop icon, then click on unlock, then watch an ad. Once the ad is done running, you get to use the font for free. Tap on check and when done, now you can move the text using this icon or using your figure as well. Just move it and adjust it to where you want. Now, instead of um, writing this text again, I'll just duplicate it and then write my tutorial on it you can just tap on this icon to edit the text now i want to change this other background to black and make the text white instead move the text again to place it properly to add an image that is the logo of the inshot we use scroll until you find pip Tap on it and then import to the image you want to add. Reduce the size or increase it however you want it and place it wherever you want. I'm just doing little adjustments here. And I've decided to change the background because the background I have is not contrasting well with the color of the InShot logo. So I'll just choose another background. And there we have it. I went ahead to add just a little more text. Once you are done and you're okay with how it looks, just tap on export up here and your thumbnail will be saved to your device. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one. Bye.